The Sundance Film Festival is considering making a move and letting other cities apply to host the festival starting in 2027. And this has many Utahns wondering whether the festival will actually stay in Park City. News specialist Lindsay Ertz has been talking with locals and visitors in Park City today. Lindsay? Yeah, the festival says their contract is up with Park City starting in 2027, and this will allow them to explore whether other cities can meet their needs. Now, we talked with visitors and locals today about what this would mean if the iconic festival were to go. Yeah, it's the identity of, of Park City, so I, I hope it doesn't happen. Moving it would open up an opportunity for a lot more people to attend. Mixed reaction as visitors and locals learn of the news that the long-standing Sundance Film Festival could be done in Utah in three years. I think it's really important for the businesses, the restaurants, the rental, the nightly rental community and the income that they're counting on. The festival has announced they're opening up a process to allow other cities to apply to host the festival starting in 2027. No representatives were available to go on camera, but in a statement, director Eugene Hernandez says we're in a unique moment for our festival and our global film community. And with the contract up for renewal, this exploration allows us to responsibly consider how we best continue sustainably serving our community while maintaining the essence of the festival experience. Yeah, I just wonder what's behind it because it's such an identifiable part of, of the of Park City experience. Visiting from Boston, Joe Malpica says it would be a shame to lose the festival in Park City, but some locals like Heather Hampstead say Sundance isn't what it used to be. You would see faces, you know, when you'd go to movies, you'd talk about what movie to go to and you'd get a ticket. Now you need to sit down with a, a road map of how you're going to get tickets what you're going to buy, what line you're going to get in, if you're going to get online fast enough. Even still, she says, for it to leave Utah? I think it'd be a sad end of an era. Now, the festival says cities can start applying now, and they should have some idea by the end of this year or early 2025 who, including Park City, may get the bid. We also got late reaction tonight from the mayors of Park City and uh, Salt Lake County, who say they're going to do everything they can to make sure the festival stays in Park City. Reporting on Main Street for KSL 5 News, I'm Lindsay Ertz. Lindsay, thank you. And speaking of which, Park City's mayor reacting to the news in a statement. Non Worrell says that we appreciate our partnership with Sundance and we want the festival to remain here for another 40 years. We will not be alone in the effort to ensure that Utah remains host to diverse new voices from around the globe.